From 2018 to 2023, the Ohio State Highway Patrol issued more than 16,000 citations for passing a stopped school bus. It's an illegal move. People still try today, putting bus drivers and students in danger. Well, new technology is available to make buses safer and crack down on these violators. It's already on several school buses in Northeast Ohio. News 5's Caitlin Hunt explains how stop arm extensions and cameras could finally put a stop to this safety concern. Claire Carl loves her job. What's the best thing about being a bus driver? What do you like most about it? Well, the kids. Mm -hmm. Every day it's something new. But like most jobs, there's things the Columbia Local Schools bus driver would like to change. Is there something that you think is the worst part of this job or something that you worry about constantly? Yeah, drivers running my red lights. It's a daily safety issue, daily. It's a problem Carl has seen since her second day on the job almost 29 years ago. But she's starting to see some changes thanks to new technology. We are transporting the most precious cargo there is, right? And I'm, I'm certain that no person out there that's behind the wheel would want to be involved in an incident or accident that would involve children in it. Transportation Director Alan Cantrell says that's the idea behind the additions of stop arm extensions and cameras. Each bus has two cameras installed right below the driver's window. And these cameras can pick up the front and back of any vehicle that passes the bus. And those videos are sent back to the transportation office and then on the state highway patrol. Basically is enough for them to pursue the person that ran the red lights. The safety upgrades for the district's 13 buses came with an almost $60,000 price tag paid for with ODE and community grants. And it's already made a difference in just a matter of a few months. The new stop arm has been a godsend for us because I have seen such a dramatic change in, in the people driving. They actually are paying attention and I can concentrate on the student safety and the well-being um, and then if I need to go back and refer to the cameras, they take care of it from there. It's why North Ridgeville City Schools continues to make similar additions to its bus fleet. Every bus on the road has one now. So anybody that really runs a bus in Ridgeville, we, we got you and we'll be able to send it into our police department. The district has been installing these cameras since 2019 and the goal is to have stop arm cameras on every bus by the end of this year to put a stop to a serious problem in the community. Get drivers that will get six in one stop. Um, we probably get up to almost about 10 plus a day um, and just violations. It's just people running our stop signs. And it's those violators that keep bus drivers like Carl vigilant on the roads as it's her job to make sure kids go from home to school and back again safely. She just asked that drivers give the same attention to the roads. You don't want to be that person that hurts a child. It not only would change their life, it's going to change the parents' lives. There's a lot of people whose lives can be really traumatized, affected by, you know, not paying attention. For News 5, I'm Caitlin Hunt. Well, there's also a new pair of bills in the Ohio General Assembly to crack down on the number of people who pass a stopped school bus. Senate Bill 62 would authorize the use of bus camera equipment, just like the ones Caitlin mentioned. House Bill 3 would make passing a school bus a misdemeanor, with a fine ranging from $250 to $1,000. The current penalty is up to $500.